with the compact crossover SUV becoming the default motor vehicle choice for many, if not most, American car buyers, though the race is on to make these car chassis-based machines project a virile air of truckishness while still driving in sedan-like fashion and providing wagon-like interior space Volkswagen, hungry for US market sales in the wake of a public image nightmare, has done what's needed to make the Tigman more appealing to American crossover shoppers, make it bigger and more comfortable we drove the 2018 VW Tigman around the Denver area last week, and here's what we learned. During the first decade or so of the SUV boom, big ol' body-on-frame trucks were the gold standard for mainstream American commuter appliances they rode like freight liners, handled like cement mixers, sucked fuel like container ships, and behaved so badly when driven like cars that American state governments felt compelled to create the puzzling SUV advertising campaign to convince SUV drivers that an Escalade didn't handle like a Malibu. Today, the compact SUV is a car. In the case of the Tiguan, it's a tall, softly sprung car based on the same modular transverse matrix platform as the Golf visiting the now closed and watering hole for plutonium workers at the Rocky Flats nuclear weapons PLAT and photo by Murali Martin the 18 Tiguan doesn't handle as crisply as its Golf cousin, nor does it offer the towering ride height that lets drivers loom over their highway competitors, but it is a perfectly reasonable commuter machine that seats for adults in comfort and projects the desired image of outdoorsy, free-spirited truckitude. Technically, the 2018 Tiguan seats 7 with the optional third row seats photo by Volkswagen of America the second row of seats fits three passengers, though a larger than petite middle one isn't going to be very happy with their arrangement the third row seats come standard in the front wheel drive Tiguans, while all wheel drive purchasers must pay extra for the feature. In practice, any human larger than about a 10-year-old is going to be clawing at the windows in a desperate bid for escape after about 5 minutes in the third row. 